me show them my Fortran like buddy. Ready? Ready? <laughs> <laughs> okay. What? My chair is what? Okay. Okay. I'll wait till a few people get on. Well, not get on, but like. <laughs> um, which is shame before I do my. Um, before I do another thing. <laughs> okay. <coughs> Actually, never mind. Sorry. We got the Metamoon Prime. Hang on, I gotta make sure my mic's actually working this time, or else it's just gonna annoy me <laughs> so much during this stream. Okay, now, and I'm gonna listen to my voice. Okay, now, and I'm gonna listen to my voice. Okay, it's much better on here. It's much, I, I like it better on here. Okay, it's good. Alright, so, <clears throat> we got the Metamoon Prime. Prime. Um, I've actually really been excited to watch it. I mean, <laughs> I've been really excited to drink it. And uh, for the last time, uh, strawberry watermelon was um, it's the best so far on the list that I've got written down there. Not written, but I've got the bottles down there. Okay, I want to start with this drink. The the thing is uneven, so that annoys me, so that does, does this stuff. Four! We got a four. It's my second best, like, I reckon this is the second best flavor that I've had. Um... With Ice Pop being the last one. Oh my god, I like this now. I can't stop drinking it. It's too good. <laughs> okay. If you're gonna try any flavors, try Strawberry Watermelon and Meta Moon. I'm calling it right there. They're the best flavors. The best, 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 best flavors. Oh, I love it. Oh, and um, when it ended, the same last time too, we were out in, um, we were out in the wild, we were out near Valentine and stuff like that, so I'm hoping they will spawn at uh, the base because I don't know how to fast travel um, back. <laughs> I don't know how to fast travel back. I just caught on how it says nutrition facts. And then that says uh, ca calories. I can read, I swear. Oh, it's nice and cold as well. It? Liquid's white though. Which that's so good. I was going to say they need to make a red one. But they've already made a red one. Imagine having like your own flavour of a really good like like, drink company. So, like, Primo Hydration. I have my own flavour. But, like, it's black and red. So, instead of Tropical Punch, which is just pure red, just black and red. That would be sick. I would love that. Oh, hey, Let me just turn my LEDs on. It is absolutely nothing. I like to have them on. They do nothing but I like to have them on. Oh,
Shady Bell. Yes. Oh my god, how do I fast travel back there though? I don't know how to fast travel there, because I can't, like, I can't be bothered to ride my horse the entire way there. How to fast travel back to... You have to go to Arthur's tent specifically. Ah, oh, then he's like a location you've been to before, and you'll appear there with your main horse after I turn. Yeah. Back to camp. Here we go. <laughs> I haven't watched YouTube just so that I can find out. No, it's like, you go there, but... Once you do make it there, um, all you do is read the pamphlet. Send Denny, Shady Bell. Oh, thank you. Mm. Oh, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. That's good. I got told you I you know, drink Gatorade because um, no one liked it. <laughs> everyone hated it. You know, not everyone, but like there were people, like, even in family, were like, no, oh, no, don't like it. You should go with bloody Gatorade. <laughs> it's, like, it's delicious. And even my brother thought it was delicious too. Good morning. Oh, of course he's all over there. That's fine, because we're going to go in here and get changed into more of a uh, city <coughs> type clothes, you know. We're going to go into my favorite clothes, but for some reason I just don't wear them. <sighs> oh my god, I literally thought it was a dead person still in the house. I'm like, why haven't we cleared it out yet? I thought we cleared it out like ages ago. Good morning, Uncle Arthur. Oh, good morning, Jack. I'm scared, Uncle Arthur. Why? Okay, kid. You'll be okay, right? Just lay down. Right, I'm, I'm next door. If anything happens, you know who to go to. <laughs>
chaps, 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 chaps. Oh yeah, la 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 la. Hey yo, hey yo, hey, hey, hey. We need that, bro. We need them. I have the deluxe boots. Bandana, <laughs> uh, gloves. Yeah, sure, why not? I've, I don't know why I didn't get them in any other color. Left equipment. Okay, uh, Yeah, modified. Down. Gloves. Look at that. There's coats. Okay, you have a dust coat. Ooh. Classic. Wool. <laughs> Arthur's hat. Military scout hat. You know what, we should sleep. It's been a while since we slept, isn't it? It's been a while. Sleep. Snap time. I don't like our snap time. Evening is fine. Let's go the evening. Mm -hmm. I don't need it, but you know, it, it'll do when it up. <coughs> okay. Let's go to good old Dutch.
Yeah, here's a problem with Arthur right now. He's he's kind of more towards the uh, low honor, and I don't know what it has to do with anything in this game. I'm very confused because yeah, it's also in online. So it's like I have no idea what it it's for, and it, it scares me. <laughs> I reckon. So I'm just trying to think of the ending. I reckon we kill Colm or Jisco in the end. I think I think that's how the story ends. We end up killing him or something, and then the gang continues to go on. Why are you facing that way? Face this way. Face this way. Hey, Dutch. Keep walking. You're late. A couple of days in this place, you turned into some clock watching city boy. What's the urgency? We need to leave forever. We've been doing well, making money, but for us all to leave together, we need enough for a boat. Now, I found a friendly ship captain. He's willing to take us to Australia or Tahiti. We just need to pay for passage and give him money for land when we get there. No questions asked. We will disappear, be reborn. Well, where the hell is Tahiti? South Pacific, an untouched paradise. Who lives there? Tahitians, I guess. We made a bit of money on that riverboat job, but not enough for us to leave and live peacefully. Where's the rest coming from? In there. So we are gonna rob that place. Well, I didn't think he was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I reckon we got a few days before the Pinkerton show, and then we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte said this place has got money. Come on! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Lenny. robbery. Behave as I tell you, and none of you will die. Annoy me, and you all will. Now remember, we just want money. Don't make us kill you. Mr. M, leave these fine folks of their valuables. Mr. S, check that room back there. I got this one. Dying. That's your choice. Not mine. Give Either me your money. Open that gate. It ain't worth my dying. Clinton's inside. Just take it. I said open the gate and let my queen. You need to give me all your money. <laughs> There's now. nothing much here. Okay. What? There's Fine, nothing yours. really here. You're sure? Yes. Then get out here and get ready for company. All of you. Behave. We don't want to hurt any of you. Mr. F, check the safe. Sure. Open it. I don't think they keep much cash in there. Open it! There's almost nothing here. There should be stacks of cash in there. He told us there was. Look again. There's no stacks. A few dollars in coins. That's it. Damn! We got a problem. There's a ton of cops out there. Come on now! We got you surrounded! That's <laughs> greasy son of a bitch! He set us up! You think? This seems like a good time for sarcasm to you, Arthur. What are you gonna do, gentlemen? Something! The trolley. The trolley! Follow me, gentlemen! Go! Now! Go! Does this trolley go to Tahiti?
good. Mind, Lenny. I'll check that. Say Lenny, stay up. Lenny, I need you to stay back, right? You're, you're, you're the young one, right? You're the new one. Yeah, sure, I want to see what you're made of, but I also want you to be safe. Oh, 
wagon intact, okay? We might need it. Head for that wagon! Shut my hat off, sir. I need it. <laughs> I'm getting on the damn way. Can escape, I guess. No. I think I didn't actually wear anything too uh, city like, eh? I wasn't able to shoot it. They told me to shoot it and I couldn't shoot it, it wouldn't let me. So you were, you were stuck. You okay back there? Don't worry about me. Just get us out of here. Next time, let's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but well, oh, I've got a beard growing already. I'll mention it. <laughs> yeah, you're a good kid. Now we each got fifteen dollars. Oh, and a quarter. Don't forget the quarter. Shut up, Arthur. <laughs> Set us up. Played me. <clears throat> Yokel. Put the law on us. What did we do to him? What did I do to him? I guess he thinks he's the king around here. He don't want the likes of you. So, what are we doing next, Dutch? We just need money. One more decent take and we're gone. The bank is our bet. Hosea agrees. Mm. Even after that, especially after that, I don't feel so good. Now you just got a bash on the head. Come on, I'm taking you back to camp. Hey, you did real good there, Lenny. Just wish it could have turned out better. Well, you can't win them all. That's true, Lenny.
Oh, this hat just suits Arthur more. Change the hat to even because if I change it to the military hat, I mean, look at that, it's not gonna, it's not like it's not like, yeah, you can see it now, kind of like I want it, but it's like it, it, it just doesn't, it just doesn't go. Just... Yeah, it's Arthur, you get the deciding vote. Well, what? You take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. <laughs> Just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to pull. Before the really year is out, we are going to be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Oh. Farmers. But we need seed capital, and we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. Trust me. It's kind of losing its flavor a bit. Turn it down again. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Arthur, come on. You better be right about this one. I am. I've heard that before, and usually I've been right. Uh, if you say so. Quit doubting, Arthur. It does no favors. Come on. We need to go see a man about a boat. See a man about a dog. We're headed to a settlement called Le Gras. I met a boatman there called Thomas. Oh, these waters like the I thought I thought he meant like the uh, joke was like, oh, so we can um, go talk to, mansion from you know, go talk to a man about dogs. I mean, no, it's saying it's just, I don't know. So he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See, I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. I don't know. Okay, follow me. Thank you. For what? For taking my side back there. It ain't about sides. Feels like Hosea's lost his spot. <laughs> this move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job? Or revenge for what happened at the trolley station. Both. Neither. <laughs> what does it matter? We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back. He also set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. I understand. We just got a lot of pots on the boil, given all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support 20 people. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life of seeds. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? You tell me, Arthur. <laughs> have some goddamn faith. I am bending over backwards to make a future for us. I know, but, 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 when did you become so small-minded? If you'd rather we break up the family, go our separate ways, just tell me. Of course not. 
This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. So either we're in this together, working together to get out together, or we're not. There simply <coughs> isn't a reality in which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. This feels like we're on the old time again. I mean, the old Driscoll's found us. Yeah. We need to move. And soon. Mm. Haven't I made that clear? I feel like all this moving, Dutch. <coughs> Micah is the only one left with any loyalty. Now, that Micah. Fair. You are That's not fair. Like John. I swear that woman is poisoning him against me. I've seen it before. Anyway, here we are. Micah does not show loyalty, Dutch. I don't know why I hate Micah. I'm trying to think of why I hate him. I have no reason to hate him, I just do. Just, I don't know, I hate him. <laughs> it is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's going to help us get close to our prey. The other night we had quite the adventure fishing for catfish. Now, my friend. Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. Look, if you bringing him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Good. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Of course. Why not? It shouldn't take too long if we can find it. Be live. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big ones. Great. Come now, Arthur. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. Well, I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth. <laughs> Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas, more of a monster <laughs> than a gunslinger. <laughs> oh, Mr. Dutch. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. All I see, yeah, they're out there. I think that's so good. It feels uh -huh. like water to me. Down here, we got a couple of crayfish traps oh, up yeah, here. Trap. Oh, uh, Mr. Dutch, you keep a lookout for company. We'll start. Check the traps with me. This one's empty. All right. I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Mr. Dutch, you show you the right fellas to be going after Angelo Brunson? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. Now stay close. Uh, sure. Make sure you follow my line. Oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. Arthur. You can see why eating in swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. Peace. Nobody bothering you now. Except for the night folk sometimes. The night folk? Yep, some strange people around these parts. Wilder than the animals. Wait, what did I just see? Well, this just That's what's on right over there. Uh, we're getting deeper. So, uh, I'm going to be honest, I'd be scared to actually do this, alright. Yo, what's the excellent map? Whoa. Stop where you are. It's a gator. Just stay uh, there's just something dead back that way, so... Hi, 
Just keep moving. I got another trap by that small island up here. I don't know what's taking Jewel so long with that boat. I think we are all equally keen to find her. Our inventory is being taken. Stuck in the mud. It happens. Right. Touch, please. Don't let me get attacked by a game. Ah. Uh. Didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. Well, What's it's true? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was. No, but only some huge could do this. Oh, fantastic. Gator. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. Alright. I suppose this can wait. Let's go. What was some big that could have eaten that? I'd say an alligator, but like. Hold up. Oh. Uh, just three more, so. <laughs> I want to turn back, please. Thank God, there's no shortage of them. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. What's that? I like seeing the middle because he that he gets attacked or Dutch gets attacked first. Actually, no, I could get attacked from the side. We really should have run into jewels by now. I reckon we should split up so we can search both sides. I'm sorry, what? Okay, Arthur, since you appear so at home here, you take the right. We'll go left. What? Just keep your eyes open. Fuck. <sighs> Big bit on this. It's a big bit on that. Ah, oh, I'm thinking. What could have I been mean, so big? It could have been that if it wasn't an alligator. I was gonna say crocodile. If it wasn't an alligator, then what was it, eh? Search this entire thing, man. Hey, someone there? Find Jules. 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 I want to stay on as much land as possible. I don't see any crocodiles here. That's not in this circle. Okay, now when I think about this circle, actually, I um, Is it on? Um, oh, pfft. Um. This is bone, isn't it? Jules, oh my god, Jules. Hey, you in the tree? What are you doing? There's a monster. A monster. 
Just okay. at it. And uh, where did this monster swim off to? That way, yep. Oh, cannon, okay, yeah, right. Uh, it's it's stuck. Stuck. Oh. <laughs> it yeah, right. It's stuck. Say they experienced this alleg this alligator, but I don't think it was true. Thank God. <laughs> so, uh, these fellas, Thomas, two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was gonna be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry too. I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we clear. You're gonna need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. <laughs> we'll see any giant monster <laughs> long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple of crack gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. That's it, Jules. Neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Jules, come on. Jules! I got ya. I. Hey, Jules, calm down. Alright, calm down, calm down, calm down. Okay? Hey, it's alright, it's alright. Jules! Jules! Jules, hey, hey, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, okay, okay, it's 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 okay, hey, Jules, it's okay, hey, hey, come on, come on, come on, all right, oh, shh, oh, uh, Dutch, his legs aren't good, oh, Oh sh his leg is literally Oh my god Oh my god Come on holy Oh god Legs done in quickly. Oh, good leg. Okay. Oh, sh oh no. Finish that son of a bitch. can't see me. Oh, my God. Go ahead. 
think he's going? Shit, that is one big old gate. Oh, your boy doesn't look too good here. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. Okay. Oh my okay. god, that was scary. You're gonna be okay. Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. I heard that. <laughs> Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. I stopped the blade. I think you'll be okay. If he don't get a fever, we can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Look who's back. God damn it. Put every bullet you got in here. Hey, Dutch, I can see it, Dutch. Okay, I think it's had enough. I don't. Jesus, can we get back now? You're gonna be okay, kid. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Normally the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kinda reminds me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. I weren't the one squealing. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules has been bitten. Oh my god. He has a monster out here. He's been bitten, but he's alive. Uh, so keep him warm. <sighs> Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you. Both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? you just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm gonna head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. <clears throat> Mr. Arthur? <clears throat> Old Brunty. A bad man. I don't know. Kill some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. He definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. Be safe. You got monsters. Well. It was it was quite scary. Stranger's got a cough up page. Good job!
Personally, I feel like it's the same weapon. Oh, shut So, Dutch, what's Tahiti like, anyhow? Arthur, there you are. Come on. Thomas, let's get going. Right you are. <laughs> hey, Bill, you were a sharpshooter in the cavalry, weren't you? What? When we get there, maybe you could help with the suppression fire. I never said I was no sharpshooter. Oh, that's right. W what was it? The nation's most loyal latrine digger, wasn't that it? <laughs> yeah, well, I fought, and I fought well. So you always tell us. You taught me something you could do with learning. <laughs> Them Indians were savages. Watch your mouth there, boy. Watch it. Only type of savage in these parts are moonshine, swilling, pompous, inbred locals. Dutch, I saw things out there. I don't doubt you saw things, Bill, but your tiny little mind was too small to comprehend what you saw. What you saw was people who lost everything to savagery, savagery of peasants. Failures come from Europe to reap some awful vengeance on God's last creation. Interesting way you boys got to prepare for a killing. I'm sorry I wasted my life trying to teach you boys. Love you, though I do. <clears throat> well, love, leave and love aside. And... <coughs> you think we got this? Don't you never leave love aside, Arthur. It's all we got. There's a lodge. Look at that. The lodge. I like it. You pick us up yonder. I got you. Thank you. Good luck to you. Come on, quick. Stay quiet. Lenny, Bill, you're with me. Arthur, John, you take the left side. If you see a shot, you take it. Okay? Good luck, gentlemen. Arthur, let's go. <clears throat> let's go. Find some cover. Two up ahead. You got a shot on him? Something creepy about these statues. <laughs> you don't like naked women pouring wine on you? It's like someone's looking at you when they're not. I'd get rid of them. Bring it up with Senor Grover, right? I'm sure it'll look good. Oh, my God. 
Ah, c'est son débogar de choc. John died? How did John die? <laughs> hey, John died somehow. Name your price. Name your price. Every man have a price. Eh? Okay, okay. No, I surrender. I surrender. I... <laughs> Should we kill him? Nah, let's take him to Dutch. You can carry it. <laughs> I ain't touching that piece of shit. Yeah, well, we can. Take from the rich. Rob only to That does not sound too good. They're right here, Dutch. Dead or alive. Got you, Lenny.
John. Zaddy. From where I'm sitting, you're the one deserving of pity, my friend. <laughs> all your men, all your money. It weren't no match for a bunch of bumpkins. You are nothing. You do nothing. You mean nothing. You stand for nothing. Me, I run a city. <laughs> and when the law catch up to you, you will die like nothing. I am this country. You, you, you are what people are running from. I possess things that you will never understand. You don't even possess your own men. A thousand dollars to the man who kills him and sets me free. What are you gonna say now? They are even bigger fools than you. No doubt. The law will find you. Already, the dogs are on the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're right. You are so right. <laughs> they are good at smelling filth, huh? So <laughs> filth! has got to be destroyed! Oh, Our friends of oh, are gonna come and rescue you, you oh, repulsive oh, little maggot! Oh, 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 oh. Call them now! You call them! The goddamn alligator, Dutch. The part that covers weakness. That part. I don't know. Well, I do. <laughs> it ain't nice. I know it. But it is us or him. I figure it might as well be him. That was unexpected, eh?
Ow, you sh stupid person. I know he's gone. Show him on the horse. Hey! Oh, shh. Pick up. Okay, now this is just going to be bad. No, no. Hey, let me show him on you. Right off to a have a damn good reason for being on my property, mister. Remember that loan you took, Mr. Davison? Well, time's long since up. I'm here to collect. Oh, I should have known. You goddamn bludgeon men are all the same. Sure, sure, I got your money. Every stinking cent. It's in the house. Hell, I'll even offer you a drink. We can toast to never laying eyes on each other again. I got a powerful thirst on me right now. How about you? Well, you gotta be stinking drunk already to do this kind of work. Uh, I like doing it sober. If you take my money, surely you take a drink off me as well. That would be the manly thing to do. Yeah, no. Let's just handle the money first. Worry about manners, <coughs> okay? I could be fishing. You were catching flies. You weren't catching fish. 
Now come on. Let's get us that death. Someone's here, boy. Oh. Wait, what's going on? Don't just stand there. Go fix us a drink. Another one, Pop? Don't give me no talk, boy. Just do it. I'll look down here for our savings. Savings? Under the sink? Best place for them. Now, where um, is them drinks, boy? I don't see nothing in there. It's right there, miss. Oh boy. Don't hurt me, all right? Son, I want to get out of here, but I can't until I find some money. This some in my footlocker. I I've been keeping it away from him. Ain't that right? That's it. I think I know the sum, and that should cover it. Ain't you the good son? You should be proud of yourself. Mm. Oh, no, because I. Uh... Oh, hell! What? Hmm. Oh, this looks good. Here, please just leave. Yeah, that's what your pop said. Damn. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Try to kill me. Oh, what's this? Um, I'm getting the letters today. Okay. Uh, oh, I could take some of this. I'm straw. Uh, ah, nothing. Okay there. Yeah. 
Why did I come back here? This is how this do it for my dinner. over here. Yeah. You guys enjoyed it. Uh, watch the next one that comes out. <laughs>